You're gonna need a car. I've got one. Not for this. We started off shoplifting. The way we looked and the fact that we were girls, no one ever suspected us. You do something in this town, I find out about it. Would you like to hear my proposal? There's tons of money to be made. Drug stores, grocery stores. A good team can walk out with as much as 50 grand in cash. I'll teach you all the basics. But the fact that you're girls, really works. This is for the ladies in the front row. We suspect three or four men of a series of grocery store heights. You can tell that's my That is not your It's mine. Fight me. It goes against human nature. We always want more and more money. This will be our biggest job yet. You're young, smart, and well kept. You can hide in plain sight and no one will even suspect you. I went to the bar, but I was looking for guys. They're chicks. I love you all, and I promise if anything happens, let's just stick together. You know how to reach me if you get caught, right? No, I don't. Exactly. One of the things I like about you girls the most is that you're still together after all this time. It's obvious that you're tight and you trust each other. She likes to crash, she likes to burn. Lessons she won't ever learn. She likes to crash. And burn. Oh, Liberty and justice for all. <laughs> Only when I pull out my nine.
which has been spoken in a speech criticizing the link between violence and religion in history. The Pope quoted a 14th century Christian emperor who said Mohammed's command to spread Islam by the sword had produced evil and inhumane results. Many Muslims took this as an insult to their religion and saw a wider issue. <laughs> Trinity of evil, which is the Pope, Bush, and Blair. Use of 14th century Pope's words in the 21st century just seems a slight bit bizarre. Absolutely bad. He shouldn't say these things, not in our days. As a world player, perhaps he learned that, you know, you cannot pull out obtuse comments from the 14th century and somehow think that they're not going to be heard or interpreted as a slap in the face today. In this day and age, all the people who have committed the terrorist attacks, they do it in the name of Islam. And unfortunately, the rest of the Muslims who have nothing to do with it, they get to, they get to take the blame for it. When you accuse a truthful person or a truthful institution, it does nothing but make the truthful institution more popular and more powerful. in a world of sin. Vanessa Kemp. How is she running away? You don't care! You stole my diamonds! Oh, we'll leave. Vanessa? Identical twins. Where have you been the last two years? Get up and bring her to me. I don't care how you do it. Who are you? The hasty ghost. Four wheels on except you're my small boy. Ah! 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 